Good morning, ESM. Today is Tuesday, December 19th, and today's a B-Day. I'm Brandon Kelly, and I'm here with your morning announcements. The theater and music departments will begin auditions for the spring musical Godspell on Tuesday, January 2nd, immediately after school. Sign-ups and information are located outside of the black box. Please see Mrs. Borkowski or Mr. Graff if you have any questions. The junior high food collection contest is in full swing. So far, the 8th grade has collected 207 items, and the 7th grade has collected 96. Really? Tomorrow is the last day of the competition. There is still some time to bring in your donations. All food donations should be labeled with your grade and placed in your grades collection box outside of the East Office. There are only two days left. The 11th annual Stuff of School project is underway. Donations are being collected between now and December 22nd. Collection bins are located in the rotunda. You may also make donations during any of our winter concert and evening events. We appreciate all donations that you can contribute to help those in need this holiday season. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask Ms. Keicher or any of our club advisors. Coding Club Holiday Celebration will be held today after school in room 2844. Please see Mrs. Spadafore if you have any questions. Holiday Spirit Week is here. Today is Character Day. Wednesday is July at Christmas time. Thursday is Ugly Sweater Day. And Friday is Holiday Theme Day. Seniors are elves or Santas. Juniors are candy canes. Sophomores are reindeer. Freshmen are presents. And the junior high is snowflakes. The World Language Honor Society is holding its next meeting today at 2.15 in room 2808. Please make every effort to attend. Now over to Kimmy and Vika with the local news. Good morning, ESM. I'm Kimmy. And I'm Vika, and we're here with your local news. Governor Andrew Cuomo is unveiling a multi-million dollar plan to combat gang violence on Long Island. The proposal includes expanding after-school programs, vocational training, and education. It would also deploy additional state troopers and investigators to work with local police. Officials hope those measures will help steer young people clear of street gangs like MS-13. Officials say a fire tore through a home in Brentwood early yesterday morning. According to Suffolk Fire officials, the blaze started in the kitchen around 1 a.m. and everyone inside the home made it out safely. A known Hempstead gang member convicted of trying to kill a teenager has been sentenced to 30 years in prison. Prosecutors say the suspect tried to gun down a 14-year-old who was riding his bike in Uniondale back in 2015. The victim is now a quadriplegic, and one doctor says he'll likely never walk again. In other news, state police say a state trooper was struck by a car while helping a driver on the off-ramp of the LIE to Sag to Coast Parkway. The trooper pulled over on the ramp around 2.30 p.m. to help a disabled motorist when another driver struck him. The driver remained at the scene and no charges have been filed in the crash. The trooper was taken by ambulance to Southside Hospital, where he is listed in critical condition and is undergoing surgery. His identity has not been released. A judge has issued a warrant for a Brooklyn couple who ran a cancer scam on Long Island. Bernie Schmidt and Vincent Fina did not appear at a Mineola court Wednesday, missing their second consecutive appearance. The pair admitted to using a Staten Island boys photo in real-life cancer battle to scam thousands of dollars from Nassau County businesses. Schmidt and Fina's defense attorney told the judge that his clients had a family emergency. They now face up to three years in prison. Some puppy refugees in Puerto Rico are set to be up for adoption on Long Island. On Sunday, the Animal Rescue Fund of the Hamptons welcomes 130 animals from Puerto Rico. Yesterday, the animals were at the AFR Adoption Center in Wainscott, and they are getting medical clearance before they can be adopted. That's all for today, ESM. Have, Have a, a great, great day. day. in the window I do hope that dog is for sale I must take a trip to California and leave my poor sweetheart alone if he has a dog he won't be lonesome and the doggy will have a good home how much is that doggy in the window? <laughs> the one with the waggly chair. You know Dasher and Dancer and Prancer and Vixen, Comet and Cupid and Dahmer and Blitzen. But do you recall the most famous reindeer of all? Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer had a very shiny nose And if you ever saw it You would even say it glows All of the other reindeer 
used to laugh and call him names. They never let poor Rudolph join in any reindeer games. Then one foggy Christmas Eve, Santa came to say, Rudolph, with your nose so bright, won't you guide my sleigh tonight? Then how the reindeer loved him as they shot it out with glee.